Hi, so welcome to day one of a new block up here in the Brisbane Valley. It's 90 minutes door to door, which is fantastic. Really fantastic. I'm used to traveling a lot more of that to hunt, so this is a real opportunity. It's a small block, and I don't mean it's tiny, but it's a lot smaller than I'm used to hunting. Um, however, I'm the only one who's, uh, who has access to this block. And the reports are that there is um, good deer activity and some pig activity. And when it comes time for the rut in a few weeks, it's not uncommon to hear some uh, roaring up in the hills as well. So today it's really about learning where I am. I'm going to follow a couple of the boundary lines and try to get a, you know, a geographic picture of, of the block in my head. And um, of course, hopefully, if I see something, I'll take it. But my expectation today is really just start the learning process. Next week, uh, wind permitting, I'll approach it from the other end so I can kind of get that idea in my head, the, the shape of the whole block. Um, on one side, just over there, it's very, very close to the road, but the rest, it backs on us. Um, very big blocks, um, so a lot of wild country to explore. So welcome to uh, Small Block Adventures. The sun is slowly setting. I've probably got about an hour of light left. Um, it's been a pretty good first day. Lots of sign, nothing very fresh though, but certainly lots of potential. I've probably covered about half the block. Um, that is the boundary. Obviously not all of the block, but around the boundaries. So next week, I want to go to the other side of the block. As I said, get that idea of the actual geographic shape of the block. Certainly, once you cross over that first ridge line, it completely changes. It's a, um, it's a, it's a bush block, it's a scrub. You can't see more than 100 metres in front of you. So I expected an awesome good game. And also, there's quite a panorama of hills around me. So I reckon this is going to produce. See you next time. G'day, it's uh, week two of my pre-rut scouting and today I'm going to head up to that hill you can see behind me and see if I can find some good stag sign. Now as you can tell it's still pretty hot, it's actually over 30 degrees, looks like we might get a storm and the humidity is really high. So um, for me mostly I'm going to be taking it easy, try and stay in the shade and see what I can see. crashing around just up on one of these gullies behind me. I have no idea what it is, but boy is it loud. Now, to be honest, there's some cattle around. I don't think it's that big, but it's crashing and thumping and smashing. So, I'm going to see what it is. So, did I ever tell you about the time that I went scouting for red deer up in the Brisbane Valley? Well, my animal identification needs some work, but my shooting's okay. As you can see, I came across this big brute, and I'm actually a little challenged about how to get him out, but we'll give it a go. Uh, so I'll speak to you again soon.